Hello YouTube, this is Minecraft Chris. Um so today if you guys are watching, I have and if you guys are new to my channel, you guys probably not know that I have an XP XP laptop with um with third generation core i3. Now I'm not gonna go through the story on how this is even possible that it's Core i3 without actually installing a new processor on it. So I'm not gonna go through that story today. But um, what I'm gonna tell you guys is I found a way to make your lag problems go very, very small with Minecraft. Okay, I don't know if this works for any. It probably works for all games, but especially. From Minecraft okay so I'm gonna actually show you something okay I'm gonna open Minecraft while recording and see I want you guys to see how fast this runs it's gonna no no not nothing installed by the way you can't have the only mod you can have installed is um Optifine is well maybe it's just for me but it, it really doesn't like make your Minecraft like that much better like like it makes it lag again. It like goes to to Optifine settings because I'm guessing maybe because they're both similar in a way, trying to make your game lag less or something. And see, look, look at that. Okay, I really don't need to go into a world to show you, but I just am because you guys are the viewers, and I know and you guys anything for you guys. So look at that. Now, F3, let's go, we have three frames per second. Here's my little survival world that I just started a couple days ago, right? Stuff in the chest and everything. And, and now we're gonna just disconnect, right? Because, like, I just, like, and now I'm gonna give you the tutorial part of this. Now, first thing you wanna go do is go into the link below download get razor razor game booster made by razor zone and they're a really good computer company um if you guys want a really good computer la gaming laptop i would suggest getting it if you're like rich and you don't if you want if you don't mind spending like over two thousand dollars on a computer which i bet most of you um do mind doing that but um <clears throat> Anyways, so this is the game booster. Oh, by the way, they sell lots more stuff than that. Just that laptop. They actually sell uh quite a bit of laptops. Um, like gaming tablet, very powerful tablets and computers. Like some tablets, um, I heard that they can run PC stuff like Steam. But uh, anyways, back to the tutorial. Uh, you just wanna once you installed it, you wanna double click it, and you wanna just give it a second. And it'll, you have to sign in. You have to have a Razer account, so you might want to just do that. Um, if you do, I obviously do. That's why it's not asking me anything about sign in. Uh, and then I already have the, I have a magic launcher. Uh, but I'll, I and the technic launcher and all this pre-installed stuff, which I'm not even getting touch. Um, but uh, you just go here. Um, go. And we have a couple things here. We have, um, let's go into where I put this thing, which is a new folder. See, we have Minecraft and Razor Game Booster. We obviously don't need to re boost Razor's Game Booster because I don't even know if that will make it lag less. But uh, you can try it with like stuff like Google Chrome and stuff like that, like applications that you find lag on your computer. But this is mostly for gaming, so if it doesn't work on like Google Chrome or something that's not a gaming, just for gaming, then don't blame me. Like I'm not the one telling you to do it. So, um, you just want to go into here and you'll see Minecraft wherever it's located. Um, then you just click the open and it come, it pops up right there. I might have already had it. I'm pretty sure I didn't. If I didn't, I'm sorry guys, it's right there. Now you just cl you just make click it so it's highlighted so it should look something like this. And you just click that and then you just click launch and it says Razor Booster is 
boosting your game. Give it a couple seconds, and it opened Minecraft. Um, you guys are gonna see a pretty big difference within the the actual capturing of the video. Um, sorry guys, I'm not using. Oh, see. Like I'm running. Last time I was, let's see how many frames. 20, 20 frames. Around 20 frames. Around 20 frames. Let's go with that. And I'm on medium render distance. I'm not on fast. All maximum settings, just because it's a laptop, it's it's gonna try not be the best. Oh, it's gonna go down obviously more. Like especially if I go into like actual places with with this stuff, it's gonna go down. Yeah. So I'm just gonna change that back to normal and fast. Um, but um, if I use fraps, it's definitely gonna lag less. I think it's gonna maybe 40 frames or something. I'm not sure. 4D, not 4, 4D. Um. So, anyways, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Uh, hope this helps. If it does, leave a like. And if you really like this video. Uh, I would suggest going to my channel, watching some other videos. If you like those, subscribe. Why not? Why not you just subscribe? Um. So, anyways, thanks for and and when you exit, it says Razer Booster is re resolving your regular settings. By the way, a little tip: you always have if you want the skin to boost every single time. You have to always open it from Razer's Game Booster. So every time, yeah, it's not a hard process actually. Every time you just have to open Razer Game Booster. Just give it a second, and right, and then you just wanna Minecraft right here, and then just click launch. Then prepares the booster game. I'm not sure what it does your computer because it's really doing not much for me. It's not lagging that much and everything, so. So anyways, and yeah, I'll, I'll just make sure so you guys don't get suspicious. It's working again. So, um, anyways, guys, please rate, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you guys next time. Um, yeah, see ya. Peace.